Hello everybody, Morty15 here again, and we're about to make another transformation video, and Rainy, Lion, wrong, 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 oh, duh, no he was not hiding, I didn't see him right there, yeah you did, you were right on him too, That's how you transform the lion from standby mode to um for the lower on um, the body the body of the wild forest sword. The main part. Randy needs to figure out some stuff about Power Rangers. Right, Randy? Mm -hmm. And now we're doing the front legs him for his transformation t from the lion to the uh, the upper torso and iron bison I can do it myself and it's so easy to put his legs in but they're hard to take out I'll put the flaps in the back now there we go just have to split his legs apart and open the 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 bottom half, and you get the upper torso, the leg parts of the iron bison. Well, now put the lion on top of the iron bison and make sure your stick to the pegs that are in the front and on below the zord and there you go there's the potosa attached to the legs now time for the eagle to come in the um, orange no the yellow eagle and he becomes the head of the megazord And if you get stuck, like I am about to, just gonna stick his wings all the way down. Or you can just take them off. You can take the head on the lower half down to the head. For the head. It took me a couple of tries to get this back on, but I can do it. And and there you go. There's the head for the Wild Force Megazord. And you can snip them, put them back in place. Now the arms, Randy. Shark Zord. Easy to transform. You can just pull his fin back and make him into an arm. Make it into an arm. It attaches to this side of the sword. Normally, you had the sword attachment for the fin. It'll go right here, but I don't have that no more. Tiger sword, white tiger. Easy to to transform. Just put her legs up like that, but make sure her feet are away in the back, so they don't get um, hindered by the shoulder. And put them back in the back of the paws like so. And transformator. And you do the same thing with the front legs, but you pull the thing out, and then push them all the way back in. And make sure they're pushed in like that. Press back in. And make sure it's forward. And there you go. There's the white tiger transformation. And there you go. You got her transformation done. 
and there is the Wild Force Megazord transformation all complete. And yeah, all done. Iron Bison head and horns go up. And there's the whole Wild Force sword. I give it a five and a half rating. Randy? Same thing. Same thing? Mm -hmm. You sure? Positively. Okay. That's been the transformation video of the Wild Force Megazord. And if you guys um, stood by for the first one, that's the Turbo Megazord review transformation. Your review on that, Mr. Spike? My review is... 10? Perfect 10. Mine is 2. So, 5.5 over 10. And the, so, that's the biggest one you guys have already done la early this week. So, for the challenge video. And this guy lost, fortunately. Because he has a harder transformation. Right, Randy? Yeah, I meant to do that for him. Okay, let's go over the articula um, articula um, articula articulation. Articulation. Uh, Randy, can you hold the camera up while they can see my face? Okay. Arms go fully around, all the way there around. No feet articulation. Head can rotate because of the transformation in the head and in and out and mouth open and close for each part of the zord in and out for the shark um, lion in and out eagle you can't really do right now same thing with the bison you can really do a little bit but you can't really and yeah, that was the articulation for the tur on um, the light, the wild force megazord. Now let's go over for the articulation for the, the turbo one. Same thing, all the way around. No head articulation, no ab articulation, but just move his legs forward and back a little. And yeah, that was the articulation of the turbo megazord. This has been. Marty 15 and Randy 20 signing off.